Hi, in this video I'm going to discuss the business model with you. I'm going to give you a couple of examples and I'm also going to show you how it works. This is business model number one. Hi, in this video we're going to talk about business model number one. I'm going to explain to you what it is and how you can use it. I'm also going to show you how it works. So uh, let's begin. Just remember, if you have question about this business model or you don't understand anything, contact me. Okay. The thing is, with business model number one, you need to keep a couple of things in mind. And the first thing is, when you have a product or services and it has minimal specification and lower customer expectation, and you have to see it like this you can produce it locally and you can brand it globally if you have one product or service that meet those requirements then you can use this business model i'm going to show you how it works as you can see this is the business model you need to keep in mind when you're reading a business model this is the important stuff your value proposition after that you're going to look okay who's going to be my customers then you're going to work okay what's going to be my key activity who's going to be my partners and what are my key resources just keep that in mind another thing that you need to keep in mind is what are my costs and what are my revenue i want to explain all this in a minute but let's start up front with the value proposition as you can see this is a value proposition if your if your product is simple small and cheap and you can produce really fast then you have value your customers need to have minimum specification about your product or services and you can see it like this when you sell it you need to sell a lot in order to make a lot of revenue the thing about this and the thing why this has a lot of value is is that when you go to the customers it's an easy product that the customer can buy and they can use it you're thinking about okay what kind of product do i need to think about Think about the computer, think about the cell phone, think about things that you really need to buy fast and it's cheap. So when you think about it, if you have these kind of products or your services, you can think about, okay, what's going to be my market? What's going to be my target group? Here you have high incomes, low incomes, or sometimes if you're global active, you also have some market that doesn't know your product. So if your product is small, cheap and simple you can sell it to the high incomes and also to the low incomes because the customer has lower expectation and the channels that you can sell it depends what kind of product you have and where you're going to sell it but your key activity is going to be like how can you make sure you can produce as much as possible for the low cost that's the only thing that you need to focus on you just need to think about okay how can i get key partners in order to pre produce my product or service for a low cost so the cost has to be really low so in order for you to sell your product let's go and look at the uh, revenue and the cost as you can see these are the revenue and the cost you just need to remember with this most business model you need to make the cost really low and sometimes in order to start your company you need um, some banks that they can give you loan in order to start the company so when you have start the company with a loan of microcredit you have to pay it back and sometimes you see by company that they have those kind of costs here but as long as you keep the cost really low you can sell your product and most time you're asking yourself you're asking yourself okay why should i get a loan because it's about product you need most of the time to buy products in order to sell them and that's why you need to loan in order to buy a lot of computers in order to sell them let's talk about the revenue the thing is the more you sell for low price the more revenue you get and that's the thing about this business model this business model is if you have a product that is simple small and cheap you can produce it really cheap the cost is really low you can sell it if you have those kind of product you can use this business model just need to remember if you meet the criteria if your customer has low expectation then you can sell this product if you have to see it like this if your customers have lower expectation you can use this business model because you can sell it to 
high class customers and also the low class customer examples c- examples of companies that are using these business models are phone companies car companies car dealers and computer companies those those kind of companies are using this business model so they buy the product in in order to sell it and they need to sell a lot in order to make a lot of revenue if you have question about this or anything related to this business model feel free to contact me this is the end of the video in this video discuss the business model with you if you have question about this business model feel free to contact me